horse lovers, today is the day that we have all been eagerly anticipating. In this video, Ariel is going to meet Esmeralda for the first time. Now they have seen each other through two fences and a gap like between the aisleways, but they are actually going to go in the paddock together today. I am really hoping that it goes well. Hopefully Belle will accept her. We're just gonna have to go with the flow and see how everything plays out. Now, regardless, there's gonna be a little bit of figuring out the herd dynamics at first, that's totally normal. Now Belle may be a little bit protective of Ezzy at first. She might chase Ariel off a little bit, pin her ears, kick out. All of that's gonna be completely normal. But if it doesn't, you know, fizzle out within a few minutes or a few hours, or as long as she's not like pinning her in a corner or totally chasing her down on a constant basis, then it's gonna be okay. But again, there's gonna be a little bit of figuring out like her dynamics and dominance and all of that. That's gonna be normal behavior, so don't freak out about that. But like I said, I am hoping that Ariel and Ezzy will be besties. Okay, let's go. So I put Belle and Esmeralda in the outdoor arena and we dragged the paddock, put a new round bale out, just prepared everything, got it all fresh and clean for the girls. Here's Ariel and Bagheera. You can see Belle and Ezzy are in the outdoor. Now, Ariel has been out here for two days. I wanted her to just settle in with Bagheera for a little while, just take it easy. But now she's gonna go out with Belle and Esmeralda because I need to use this paddock and also because that's where she's gonna be. Now, Ariel has gone through a lot in the last couple weeks or so, but this is gonna be her last major transition. And then she can just settle in and get used to life here at Free Spirit Equestrian. So. Fingers crossed that this goes well. I know that this is stressful for her overall, but this is gonna be great because she's gonna be with her herd and she's not gonna have to adjust to anything else like in a major way. Okay, Belle, you gotta be nice to the new baby, okay? This is our, our talk, our pep talk, okay? You be nice. You gonna be good mama? Yes. You gonna be good mama? Ezzy, you gotta be nice too. Ariel, you're gonna go into your new paddock and then you're done moving around. You get to be outside with friends and get to settle in. She's been so good. She hasn't cared about anything. So happy. You think they're gonna be best friends? Oh yeah. I hope Belle will be we'll okay. Along. You excited? Excited. About your, your uh, Bay Roan? Yeah. She's so cute. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna open this green gate because here's the aisleway. That's the paddock. We're gonna open this black gate over here plus this green one and kind of create a way for them to move through. I'm gonna lead Bagheera out and just have Ariel follow her. I think that'll make sense for what we're doing right now. Okay, so step one, let's move Ariel and Bagheera into the paddock. And the cool part is it's gonna be all the mares here at Free Spirit Equestrian are gonna be in one paddock. So normally I don't like separate mares and geldings. That's just how it's worked out because of course they're foals and it's totally different dynamics. Eventually they'll all be together, which will be really cool. No idea when that's gonna be. But yeah, it's so cute that they're all gonna be together, the girls. So what we're gonna do here is kind of set up a barrier. Kyle will also be standing here. Cause I'll, like I said, I'll lead Bagheera in and hopefully Ariel will just follow. So happy for her to be in with all of them though. I think getting Bagheera and Ariel in here will be easy, but then trying to get Belle and Ezzy from the other gate in here with all the excitement going on, that might be something, we'll see. Right now I'm opening the green gate and as you can see, I have Bagheera on the halter and lead. What I'm going to try to do is walk Bagheera over to Ariel to see if she'll follow or try to get Ariel to move forward and walk out of the paddock first. Either way, we'll be in front of her or behind her. We're just going to do whatever works. So first, I'm going to kind of walk Bagheera by her, see what she does. She moved forward a little bit, but she didn't really understand to follow her. Ariel was a little confused about the gate. So what I'm going to do is walk Bagheera back in go around and ask Ariel to move forward and then she'll go out the gate first and then she'll either go walk right into the new paddock or she'll walk behind Bagheera. So let's try that.
perfect. Ariel figured it out. She walked out of the gate. So now I'm going to shut the gate and then we'll go into the new paddock. Ariel is now officially walking into her new paddock where she'll be with all of her friends. And once again, Bagheera did such a great job helping. Now Ariel and Esmeralda will officially meet through the fence for the first time ever as he's so excited and Belle immediately intercepted. Oh my gosh. Belle wants to come in because the round bail was just put out here. <laughs> You're mad because you don't have the round bail. You're coming in here. That's literally why she's running is because she knows that we just put the round bail out. Look at these two. All right. Belle, you're coming in here. You better be nice to this baby, okay? She's like, this is my pen. Who's that? You being good girl. <laughs> Belle is honestly a total diva, like a complete queen. You be nice to that girl. Azzy. Figure is like, whatever, I don't care. That's not for snack. My goodness. So far, it's fine. It's just gonna take time for Belle and everybody to settle in and truly accept Ariel into the herd. I mean, it doesn't matter what horse it is. This is how it always is when you first introduce them. They have to figure out, you know, the herd and they have to just get settled in with the dynamics and all of that. So nothing crazy is happening thus far. This is also normal for the new horse to kind of be off by themselves for a little bit. Again, it's just part of horses. The longest that I've seen this go on is usually like a week or two and then the horse really really acclimates you okay girl it's okay i know baby you're doing so good <laughs> sweetheart She's like, I'll just eat grass over here. That's fine. You be nice, Belle. Be good mama. Just hanging out. We're out here putting some round bales out. Ariel's doing good. She's still kind of off by herself. Again, totally normal. It's just going to take a few days, but so far all is well. Ariel is getting closer, but Belle is still being protective, which totally makes sense. It's okay, Ariel. Big bad Belle.
<laughs> Can you be nice to the newcomers? She's always like that though. She was like that with Bagheera too at first. And then she's like, okay, you're fine. You are not being very welcoming. Ezzy, you're gonna love her. Your mama just has to let you play with her. Yeah, you just won't play, but mama's being mean. Esmeralda is definitely curious about Ariel and she wants to walk over to her, but again, Belle is being protective, which is totally understandable, but it's so cute how she's looking at her and wants to go by her. So fingers crossed that eventually they will be able to. You already had your grain, miss. Nope, you already had yours. You already had yours, Miss Belle. Nope. Hi, Yezzy. You're a good girl. You're so pretty. <laughs> you are adorable. You're adorable. Hi, baby. Hi. I love you. What do you think, Penelope? What do you think? Hi, girl. You're just a hungry girl. You're just hungry. <laughs> Where are you going? Eat your grass over here. Yum, yum, huh? She's such a cutie. Like a bulldozer okay so i'm gonna keep checking on ariel periodically and then i'm gonna show you guys how they're doing in the morning it's morning time and it's really dark but ezzy and ariel are in the back just hanging out it is so sweet you can hardly see but look when it's lighter out i'll come out here and get more videos of them but they are besties and Miss Thing is being nicer. Hi. You with your friend? With your friend? Hi, baby. Hi. Hi, baby. Let's go see Ariel. Come on, Ezzy. Let's go see your friend. You're such a good girl. You happy? Spread your guys' hay everywhere, huh? What do you think, Ariel? Hi. Hi, honey. Oh, you jelly. Yes, you the first baby. You the first baby. You like your sister? She had a little friend for you? Little friend? Let's go see Ariel.
You're so happy here. You're so happy. I'm so happy for you. You good girls. Horse lovers, it has happened. It has happened. Belle has officially accepted Ariel into the herd and she's allowing her to come closer to the round bale. And she's no longer trying to chase her off or be very protective of Esmeralda. So this is a great sign. She is eating out of the bale barn with her. And yes, we just got a ton of rain. So please ignore that. <laughs> Look at now as he's like, I'm just hanging out over here. Oh my gosh, this is perfect. I'm so happy. So I literally just woke up and walked out here. So she has been out here for like two and a half days now. That's all it took. So, you know, you saw all the shenanigans in the beginning. It doesn't take much. The horses just have to adjust and figure everything out. And all is well, I'm so happy. Look at this. It just makes me so happy. Look at that. You being nice to that baby now? Mama Belle? You being nice to that baby? I told you she wasn't so bad. Hi. The weather has been a little crappy, but despite that, Ariel is settling in so beautifully. Yes, you are doing so good. Belle has fully accepted her. Wait, what? Are you kidding me right now? Esmeralda, what? What are you doing? Hi. Girl, no. No, 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 no. Get out of the bail barn. Dude, can you not do that? That scared me. She's fine. It's just, nothing's gonna ever be perfect. Oh my God. Are you kidding me right now? Belle, can you control your child, please? You good girl. Oh, baby. It's okay. Crazy girl. So yeah, Ariel is fully accepted. Yeah, sorry, I had to break up your little, whatever was happening there. Hi, sorry. Mama Belle's being nice now. Hi. That wasn't very good watching skills with your child, Ezzy. Hey, baby. Hi. Hi, baby. Good girl. Yeah, I know. Oh, you good girl. Just full of trouble around here. Yeah, nursing can't be that comfortable. No thanks. Personally, I never want to nurse a child, but that's just me. Oh, Ariel, you sweet girl. I'm so glad you're being nice now, Belle. It's awesome. And then eventually, once it's a little bit nicer and drier outside, I want to put them out in the pasture and let them really run around. But of course, you know, you gotta ease into things. I have enough uh, drama around here with the horses, as you can see, but I love them all so much and they are all wonderful. It's just horses, to put it bluntly, horses just do stupid stuff sometimes. No matter how safe your environment is, they just find a way to do crazy stuff. Yes, but look at the babies, look at the babies. Come on, Ariel. Hey, Ezzy, what are we not gonna do? We're not gonna go in the bail barn. It's a bail barn, not a full barn. Oh, look at the milk, just dripping. Just living life. Hi, Bagheera. Yeah, you're a good girl. 
I don't want to see that again when I walk out here. Oh, good girl. Hi. Look at your milk nose. Look at that milk nose. So when am I going to wean Ezzy? This winter. That's the plan. I'm going to do like a slow pasture wean type thing. Not 100% sure on the details quite yet because I've never done it before and I have to continue my research. But it will be sometime between December and February. And of course, little Miss will be there to help out. Hi. Ezzy cannot handle when the attention's not 100% on her. Yeah, you missed thing. You missed thing. Born privileged here. <laughs> Pretty nice. Never had to go through any actual trauma. How incredible. What? Yes, I'm going to feed you soon. That's literally what she wants. Waiting for grain, huh? Starting to rain a little bit. forget you who would forget you oh. they're sharing grassies that's nice Forget Mama Bell. We could never, never. Bagheera again. She's like, whatever. I got the round bale. A lot of you were asking me, will I be able to halter and groom and handle Ariel now that she's out here? So I have been able to get a halter on her. I didn't film it just because I want to just spend time with her. I don't film every single thing I do, believe it or not. So you know what I mean. I just put the halter on, let her around a little bit. I've groomed her. And of course, I will show you a video doing that when I get the time to actually film it. But what I'm going to end up... <laughs> Look at these babies. So now you are finally able to see Esmeralda meet Ariel, and it was just awesome, all things considered. I'm just so happy that they're together now, and I cannot wait to see their future and their progress. So I will be doing an update video in the next few days so you can see a little bit more of their daily life. And I have some other really fun videos coming up. So just make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe to the channel, turn on your notifications so you don't miss anything Free Spirit Equestrian, and I'll see you next time, horse lovers.